guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I think the last time that I posted was New Year's Day <laughs> uh, or New Year's Eve. I think that was the last time that I had posted um, a video. Um, so I feel like we have a lot to catch up on. It's been a good two weeks since that happened. Um, today is the January 13th. Um, I got a new job. I love it. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's what's new with me. Um, so let's get into the video. Okay, you guys. So today's video um, is actually a request by my sister. Shout out to Kelly Struble. Um, she wanted to wear her hair really curly tomorrow, um, because she is mentoring at my mother's school. So, um, she doesn't know how to curl her hair with a basic flat iron. So that is what I'm going to show you guys today. Let me see if I can get a good angle, which I think this is actually really is a good angle. So I'm just going to put you guys like right here in front so y'all can see. Okay, so I'm going to section off my hair. I usually section it off bottom to top. Um, that's just the way that I prefer it. Um, my hair has been in a bun for two days. Um, so what I'm just going to do is I'm going to take some dry shampoo and I'm just going to spritz in some dry shampoo right now. I like to use a little bit of this Trust Maze Extra Firm Control um, Mousse, and it is number four. So I just like to use that. You don't have to use, you really don't have to use any of this. Um, I like to because um, I uh, I like to kind of keep it in and keep my curls in a little bit. So I just like spritz it in my hand, rub it together, and then I go from underneath. Because if you go from on top, you're just gonna get like, um, you're just gonna get like shiny wetness, and that's not something that you want. So, okay, so I clean my hair, and then I put a little bit of mousse in it just to keep it, um, together and then I just have trust me's number four um hairspray so I'm just gonna do a little bit more mousse and I will be done with that and this is just to kind of keep your hair like really um like curly and like not Are you my audience today? Oh, we have another audience member. Hi. Well, there's the third one. What are you guys eating? Are you eating ice? What is that? Is that ice? I know. You've been my audience member since the get Kobu. Since the get go, Kobu, you've been my audience member. <laughs> I hope you like my audience members. They're all in here with me now, so I apologize if it gets a little loud or crowded. Okay, so I'm gonna show you on the left side of my head because um, the side is just a little, I'm gonna show you one on either side. So right now I'm just, you know, sectioning off my left side and I like to put a hair tie around it. Hey y'all, Hey! Um. I just like to tie this section up just so that it doesn't get into this section over here. Okay, so curling your left and your right si um, sides of your head 
is very different in the way that you use your straightener. And for purposes of this, I have brushed my hair out and I have turned my straightener on so it is um, heated up. Okay, so I'm just gonna grab a little bit of a section and I take about an inch. I mean, depending on how big I want my curl, I'll take about an inch and I'm doing the front piece. Okay, so how you hold it is very important and I I hold mine very differently than every other person, so bear with me. Okay, so when I'm on my left side of my head and for you people watching this, it, this will be your right side, um, but this is my left side. So when I'm on my left side and if I'm looking in the mirror to you guys, I will hold my, um, I will hold my splat iron just like this with my hand, um, with my, the top of my hands right here and kind of positioned up here and then my thumb down here. How I will do it is I will flip my hand just like that and I will take it just like this, clamp down and then twist back up to that original position and then you just kind of slide the hair through. Now, that's a pretty curl, right? Like, that's a pretty good curl. If you want more of a curl, what I like to do is start like that, twist. And I like to keep twisting down so that the curl has more bounce to it and more curl on it. All right, so let's show you guys again. Grab up a section. Okay, like I said, you're gonna hold it just like this. And um, this is, if you're wondering, this is the Pro Silk Nano um, curl, uh, straightener. So I hold it just like this. I will grab and twist my arm just like this. So my arm, my hand is just like this. And this is my left side, guys. So then I will go like this, clamp down, twist, and then pull straight down. And you see me curl, you see me twisting the flat iron. Me twisting the flat iron is just ensuring that I get more curl in my hair, cause my hair is so long. That's just ensuring that I get more curl in my hair in each part. You see, so I twisted it a few times and honestly, when I'm twisting, all I'm using is my fingers. That's all I'm using. That's all you should be using is your fingers to twist it. So let's do one more for practice. Okay, all right, so I'm here. I'm twisting, clamping, Twisting, pulling straight down. You see? And you get a curl. Just like that. Perfect, right? Okay. Now, I'm going to finish curling this side and um, then I will show you an example on the right side. Um, I took actually bigger sections that's why my curls are so loose um, when you take bigger sections your curls are going to be looser um, so now that I showed you the left side I'm going to show you how to curl on the right side so I like to have a lot of control where's my clip okay so I'm going to show you with the front pieces Okay, I'm just gonna, since my other um, half of my hair is curled, I'm just gonna clip this bad boy up top here. Okay, so right here, 
and I like my bangs to be extra super curly so this is my technique for that now I realized that I showed you on this side um, how to curl them away from your face and I did the whole side away from your face but what you can do is I'm gonna start with a back piece you can curl them towards your face as well and curling them towards your face will um, just ensure that um, <clears throat> that your hair is thicker and fuller. I don't curl towards my face because my hair is already super thick, so I don't need that thickness or volume. But when you wanna curl towards your face, you're gonna go like this, and you're just gonna go like this, and make sure the hair comes on the outside because it's gonna make your curls different. right there's a curl and see how see how the curl goes and it curls towards my face that way and then with my next section I'm gonna curl away from my face so I'm gonna start this way so my hands are underneath and I'm gonna go down. Okay, and then you see how the curl faces away from my face. So you see that? So this curl over here is towards my face. This one over here is facing away from my face. Now with your bang pieces, you always want them to face away from your face. And okay, so how I'm holding this differently, this is my right side, I am right-handed. So how I'm holding this differently, instead of holding it this way first, how I'm holding it is I'm holding it this way on how we did on the other side. So remember, on the other side when we would go to curl, I would turn it this way and then pull this way and then twist my hand this way to curl. This way, I'm holding it this way first, clamping down, and then twisting my hair onto the flat iron and pulling through. Okay, so let me show you one more example. I'm gonna pull this way, grab your piece of hair, clamp it, twist, and pull. And do that one more time because that one was a little feisty of going through. You see? And they are all super curly. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly curl this side of my hair and I will show you the final results. <laughs> of curls I also took really really big sections if you want more of a tighter curl you're gonna take like super tiny sections um, it will take you a while my hair is super thick so it usually takes me about two hours um, but yeah that is how I curl my hair with a flat iron um, I hope this video was very helpful for you and I hope that you guys enjoyed it and um, please leave a comment down below if uh, it helped you or maybe um, taught you some new things about curling your hair with a flat iron um, so yeah I will see you guys in my next video and I hope you all have an amazing day and remember it is a life worth fighting for I will see you guys in my next video bye everyone Thank you.